one rice pudding for dessert. This pit is four feet wide, five feet long, and about three feet deep. Once the pits are usually dug, we look for firewood. We don't burn any kind of firewood. We like a good hardwood. Something what we call kiabi. It's uh, similar to mesquite. Hardwood gives good strong fire. If you don't have, we don't have them. Use the Australian pine for the iron wood. The wood is cut in pieces and put on the bottom. On top of the wood, we put this porous rock. It's called pohaku. It's lava rock. It has been rolling in the streams and it's wrong at all. You want to go home and try something like this? Fine. But don't use your rocks. Most of your rock is solid. If you heat them up, they explode like a bomb. This gets red hot. So once the, ro once the rocks are placed on the firewood, the fire is started. But an hour and a half or two hours later, the rocks are red hot. The leftover firewood is then taken out. All that's going to cook the thing in here is just the hot rocks. While the fire is going, we go out into the garden and cut some of the banana plants. The banana in Hawaiian, we call it maipa. The trunk of the banana contains a lot of water. That is cut in pieces, mashed, and put on top of the hot rocks. On top of that, we put the banana leaves and the tea leaves. And this is where the pig would sit, right on top of it. Now the pigs we use are raised commercially, but again, it's all nice and clean. All we got of is seasoning. Now there's only one kind of seasoning we use. It's called pa'akai. I want rock salt, sea salt. It's run through the cavities of the pig. The thick pot slits the meat and salt is how it helps most of that fat. This type of cooking is like steaming and roasting. Most of the fat on things are melted down to the bottom of the pit. On top of it, we have a different type of leaf we call lai on the tea leaves, which gives good flavor to the pork. In the pot, that's the Hawaiian rice pudding. That's dessert, you gotta try it, it's good. And this pit is so hot, you can take this pig out, put another one in here. Wait, tomorrow morning, you cook. Thank you for coming out of here. If you want to take pictures of the guys, I'd love to have you. Otherwise, take it over the bridge. The bar's open. Have a good evening.